today I just wanted to make a short video about my favorite website that I've been using lately and it's chess.com. About two months ago I wanted to play chess online and I Google searched and I came across chess.com and it probably is the most popular online chess but um, so anyhow I used to play chess as a kid and so I, um, I realized that um, you could go ahead and play for free, and that was great. I had a lot of fun. They, they do offer packages. Um, the difference in the packages is not, um, not that they, um, for example, they, they don't lock things down. You can, you can play all the games regardless. But um, it goes down to the tools that they provide, like the chess lessons, the chess tactics. And also they have a computer analysis, things like that. I, I haven't fooled too much with that, but check out chess.com for information on that. But anyhow, I created an account and I went ahead and started playing immediately. Every time I get on chess.com, there's always thousands of people that are playing and are from all over the world. I mean, even you name it. My, I've, I've seen, a, I th um, it's hardly ever that I see a flag that I've never seen before, but I played with, I played with people, I'm in the USA, and I played with people in North Korea and Iran, and, uh, and those are countries that, you know, um, that, you know, there's some turmoil going on between us, but we're all here to play chess, and that's what we do, but forget all that, um, so basically, people, all, thousands of people all over the world are playing chess online, and it's great, you can tell you can request many different games, like um, the time limit. If you are if you want to play a deep thinking game, you can play a 60 minute game. Or you can play speed chess one minute. Or you, you know, you, whatever floats your boat. So there you have it. So what happens is when you play, you're randomly assigned white or black, and there you have it. They also have, beside just standard chess, they have these other variants. I haven't played too many of them. They have this one called Live 360 where they, um, they jumble up the bottom row, uh, the Rooks, Knights, you know, stuff like that. They kind of randomly play some on, and they're the same on both sides, but and that's how you start off the game. And um, I guess I, I guess that's um, that that seems like it'd be a really good game to to um, develop um, how you use your pieces, developing your position, things like that. But uh, I haven't got into it. Um, there's one called Three Check, first person to check the other guy's king three times wins, um, so I guess keep your king well guarded. Um, I did play that once, and I put everything I could around it, um, but the, the thing is, or you can checkmate. Um, king of the hill is first person to get the king to the center of the board, so the other, everyone's trying to, like, build a blockade. Crazy house is every piece you take from your opponent, on your turn, you can you can place it anywhere on the board, and um, that counts as your turn. Um, play it. It's maybe it's easier to imagine, easier to play than imagine. Bug House is pretty much the same concept, except you have a partner, and every piece your partner takes from their opponent, they're playing black or white. You're playing the opposite of that of your partner. And so you get your partner's captures, and you get to use those. Um, but the game that I 
been playing a lot lately has been four-player chess. And I started playing it just to see. I think I, I think I might have saw like a video or something. And I'm like, wow, that seems kind of fun. And so anyhow, um, anyhow, I started playing it. And um, I, I guess that's pretty much every, all I play. Um, so, uh, but, um, beside, beside the games, uh, this is, this is a great site. I'm glad they put this site up there and, and if you can afford it, definitely get a membership, um, become a member, um, because it's, it, it's well, it seems well worth the money. The, um, besides just the playing, um, they have all these ways to learn. So if you don't know how to play chess and you want to impress your friends um, and say, I play chess, I am smart, well then you can go to chess.com and under lessons, they will, they will, um, and these are good lessons. These are like, these are like, um, they will tell you the rules, the basic, and this will get you started in, in no time. Maybe a couple of weeks, you'll, you'll be like, you'll be like, hey, that's, um, I'm a chess player. I know, I know how to play, and you'll, you'll even learn, um, you'll learn, you'll learn a, if, you, if you've never played, you'll learn a move called in descent, and, Sometimes when you're a beginner and you see that and you're saying, what just happened? But a anyhow, um, that's good. Um, some lessons are great. They have videos. They show live tournaments. Um, and the people that are on here are all the way from the beginners. A lot of beginners. Um, I mean, they're very evenly distributed. I mean, players of all ranks. But even the world champion plays on the site and um you can watch people play live and and um you, you can observe games and also they do they videotape like tournaments um you know they have one in saudi arabia and one in uh, all over the world they they go and they film them and you can watch it live and so it's awesome and beside that, um, they offer these things up, these things up here called tactics, where they, let's see, I might have, okay, it, um, it wants you to pick the best move, so, um, Interesting. I'm, I'm stumbled on this because, um, I mean, I know how I would play it. I take, he takes, but that's really not giving me any advantage. Um, it's going to tell me wrong. Oh, okay. Well, maybe it just wanted me to take it. I thought there was it was some trick. But it gives you tactics. It places you in um, various positions, and so um, so you can learn the skills. And in some of the lessons, it'll it'll do something very similar to this, and it'll tell you why that is the best move. You can see that I'm I totally suck. I, I mean because. It's, I just, um, I don't do well at the tactics, you know. So, um, beside that, um, let me tell you this. Well, first of all, when you become a user, everyone gets a, gets a home page, a profile page. And I don't think, I'll, I'll show you one. This is, okay, it's, it's, 
it's basically this is one of my friends you can add friends you have you get friends on chess.com and you can tell people i play chess i'm smart and i have many friends okay well this this guy i met um he's from india i don't know he could be a kid or he could be 90 years old or whatever he might not even be from india but I know he's not a lion because um, he does type, and I've never seen a lion type. I've seen a golden retriever dressed up as a lion chase people, and that was funny. But any, anyhow, it shows their ratings and, you know, and trophies, and I guess they get trophies if you, um, no one's given me one. If you want to, my, mine is Chess Rocks 06. Okay, and then they tell, um, then they tell on your profile, they write notes. So, like, this guy was upset because he just leaves the game when, when leaving, uh, when losing. So, um, so if you play, like, a butthole, or there are buttholes out there, they will, um, they, you, you will get some bad comments. Excuse me. Um, okay, so um, you see, I was getting no comments, so I put my own comment. Great player, and then someone put nice player. And you, you might be saying, "Why does this? Why does this guy here? Um, he does not have the voice of a twelve-year-old kid, and that's not my son." And I even put this. I like chess.com. It helps me practice for our chess club. If we play, don't stop playing. You, you know, I did that to, I did that kind of as a, kind of because I'm screwed up and I had something. But um, the reason I did that was um, for fun at first because I was going through a winning streak and I wanted people to go to bed at night thinking that they lost to a 12 year old and also on top of that um also on top of that um i i thought you know well maybe they'll think ah oh, he's just a kid i'll i'll try some experimental moves and blah 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 and then the other um and you can see from my ratings um I, there's nothing spectacular here um, I try when I do play like standard chess, these guys, I am trying to, I am trying to learn more. So I try different openings and I flop a bunch of them. And so, um, check back in a couple months. You'll see that I'll be leading the Magnus little I'll be on Magnus Carlsen speed dial. But, um, hey, Paul, what should I do? What should I do? Man, E4. Okay, but regardless, um, regardless of that, um, that's why I put the kid, people take it easy on me or, or go to bed at night. I got beat by a 12 year old, blah, blah, blah. But anyhow, today, Here's my profile page, and it shows all my friends, and um, these are all people I played games with. I'm not collecting friends, but see, this is cool. If you join, if you if you start playing on Chess.com, you're gonna have fun. For number one, number two, you can brag to your friends. It doesn't matter if you're a nerd or a jock, or you, your presentation will be different. If you're a nerd. Don't, don't worry. Once you get out of high school, you're, you're going to be, you're, um, you're going to be so set for life, um, if you're a brainiac. But if you're a jock, um, and you play chess, you probably will be set for life too, but the jocks just approach it differently. Um, they just say it more cool. Hey guys, I'm not going to hang out with you tonight. Go play some chess. Chess? What do you mean? Chess? Okay, but the nerds, yeah, you know, so you get what I'm saying. But anyhow, these are my friends. 
And so number three, the third reason for chess.com is you can say, I have fun. I play chess. I'm smart. And you don't. And number three is you can say, and I have friends. So if you don't have any friends and people are um, don't like you at school, you got friends on chess.com. And here they are. This is proof. But anyhow, this leads me to my the whole reason I I wanted to um, do this video. I was playing four-player chess, and I think I was red. And across from me, um, across from me was one of my friends that I added on that game. I saw I saw a picture of a pretty girl. And I clicked on it and it opened up her profile. And I, and if they're not your friend, there's a little button that says add friend. And I added it. And I do that sometimes. Well, I do that with all the pretty girls. But um, I'm, uh, because I'm single. Uh, okay. But, but number, um, and I like women. And women are cool. Okay. So, so anyhow, um, I added her as a friend. Now, she has to accept the friend request before I'm her official friend. Otherwise, I'm just a stalker or, like, a follower or whatever. But regardless of that, um, I looked on her profile. And uh, one of the reasons, um, the main reason I added her as a friend was because she looked hot. Number two was because maybe she'll say, hey, um, if she, if she was a, like a really good player or whatever, maybe she'd say, I'm not going to attack Red because he wants to be my friend. Okay, so, so anyhow, I noticed today I was looking, you get these messages every time you add a friend, it tells you, um, it tells you, um, under messages, um, I accept your friend request. Okay, so, <clears throat> I added this lady, and we, um, any, anyhow, we, so, um, and I didn't want her to think I was a little kid, so, I just said, do you play a lot on, I used to, so people take it okay and then we just started talking and a light bulb went off inside my head and i started thinking oh my god just our comp oh like here forty thousand players are online right now playing and there's 20 million members yeah I and mean, so what there's six billion seven billion people in the world there's 20 million people playing chess. And that's awesome. Okay, so, but regard, okay, going back to what I was saying. Now I have this pretty hot friend. And a light bulb went on and I said, this could be great. I mean, chess.com is probably the best dating site there is. Because, um, Number one, think about it. You meet someone, you have something in common right off the bat. And you got some inside jokes. You know, like, um, you, you know, like, I don't know. You guys end up getting married and um, the, um, and, um, oh, I, I don't know. They're going to work and you say E4, you, you know, or whatever. You, you get what I'm saying, or, or if you're having a bad argument, and you know, and for things raise voices or people start crying, you say, "Hey, let's just settle it." If you want, if you beat me at chess, I'll go to that movie. And if um, and if you win, if I win, then let's do this, you know, and um, and also too by meeting a chess girl, chess. A girl that plays chess just adds to their hotness. Um, I mean, so you could have a girl that, like, on the hot and crazy matrix. Um, for example, let's say 
she's a six, but um, she plays chess. That makes her. That makes her. Um, that makes her more like a seven point two. So, so I mean, that's that's awesome. You guys have something in common. You know, you're not marrying a dum dum and or dating a dum dum, and also. Um, you know, if it's um, down the line, you're dating, and it's like, man, it's Friday, and it's rainy out, and, you know, we don't want to go um, to the discotheque or whatever, I don't know, the dance club, and, um, well, you want to play a game of chess, honey? Sure. Okay, you, you get it. So, so, um, all these thoughts just hit me at once and I'm like chess.com dating site so I'm gonna keep you up to date on my on my new romance I'm um and I encourage every single person if you're married don't even think about this um you, because you know you're just it's um you, you will not it will not end well and you will um, you will be checkmated and stalemated because um, uh, your house will not be happy. <laughs> First of all, your wife will be, why are you always playing chess with that girl? You know, or whatever. But um, what, I, what I encourage all people on chess.com that are single and um, are dating age, start, start using it as a dating site. Because, because, um, and, and, and be careful. Some of those, um, some of those profile pictures aren't the aren't the people. I mean, like me, I'm I'm a little kid, right? Okay, well, I'm not. Okay, but um, some of those pictures, like if you see something that looks like a cover of like a girl magazine, um, Vogue or Girls World or Women, I don't know. Um, that's probably a dude you're talking to, you know, and you can, you can kind of tell if they're chatting or whatever, you know, you can tell if they're, um, so be careful because if you start dating and your first day, you might be dating a dude, but the, the thing is, um, and, and for you single girls, I mean, this is, this is a way to, to meet, you know, if you enjoy chess, but, I'm talking to the single men here. I mean, use this as a dating site. Add friends and um, but leave my girls alone. And because because they're mine, they're my friends. And um, and you know, have fun with it. You know, have um and um. Oh, I referred to like, you know. It, on the matrix if like the girls is six it makes her 7.2 i was referring to james jagger he's a good friend of mine i went to high school with him he has a big youtube channel and um well they actually took his youtube channel down but he has a new one and like in the first day he got his twenty thousand of his hundreds of thousands of subscribers back um that's um forget about that but anyhow he did um he has a video on there that went viral and it's called the hot and crazy matrix so if you haven't seen it um watch it um youtube search hot and crazy matrix and and i encourage um i encourage all my chess friends and foes or opponents or whatever people at the chess.com go out and meet someone you know you can uh, you can't stay you can't stay indoors on your mobile device play chess all day you gotta go have some interaction go go out and eat walk you know do you know do some normal things Meet your meet your um, significant other if you're single and um, and and just um just just enjoy it. So, um, but it, that me take my words on it. We're gonna we're gonna see chess.com 
it's um it's probably there's probably going to be articles written how how chess.com in the future turns into like the biggest dating site you know there's um what's uh, match.com and that other one that um the older guy that he's a doctor and he you he, he does a big psychoanalysis psycho babble of um i don't know what it's called but it's um you you probably get the gist so um anyhow i've rambled on like i always do so chess.com have fun get friends meet hot chicks and oh and be sure um be sure to subscribe and like my videos i mean even if you hate it still subscribe because um because um i i'm not doing i have a couple of youtube channels that are monetized and those are for i use for just you know um i use the money for just fun stuff but this this um this this channel i'm using um after playing four cha player chess, I really wanted to learn, you know, some strategy. And it's hard to do when you're in a game or watching games. And um, there, there was a, there was a guy out there. His name, he has a YouTube channel. His name's Dubious Skills. And I watched one of his videos, and I immediately. This was like the first or second week that I started playing um, four-player chess, I, I went from like a 13 to playing in the 1400s, and I, I got very, I'm, I'm going to break the 1500 rating very, um, very, very soon. And, uh, but what, what I'm saying is, um, I, I just, um, these, this YouTube channel, I know my videos, um, I, the, you know, I, ju I hope people get things out of the, them, and also, um, also be sure to comment, and we'll probably, we'll probably, if you play four-player chess, we'll probably, we'll probably have played each other, and, um, well, you know, so when we're playing, um, you know, don't, don't ask me to team up, because, I don't like doing that because when people team up on me, you know, bad things happen. Um, but, but the thing is, you know, um, and, and also too, if you play on a PC or a Mac, download a screen capture tool and um, start start sharing your knowledge. Like, you know, because this is, uh, I, th I think four-player chess is going to, um, I think it's really going to take off, but, um, I know it has for me in my life, but the thing is, you know, 20 years, it's going to be in the Olympics, uh, it's pr probably the Winter Olympics, um, uh, but, um, but the, the thing is, you know, I think it's going to grow and grow and grow, and as it grows, I, I mean, there's no books written, there's no... There's the only opening, the one that I, I use, I'm starting to venture off from it, but it's a solid opening. If you want to know a very good opening, go to um, YouTube search Dubious Skills. He's on the leaderboard, his name. He's one of the top 20 players, and he has a YouTube channel, and there's this one, I think it covers the basics in it. It, it tells you a very solid opening, and it's it's one of those that even if all three of the players are like, we're going to team up on this person at first, that they're they're going to have a hard time doing it. So um, sure, okay. So so now our list is use chess.com, have fun, meet hot girls. If you have a PC or a Macintosh, 
start uh, open up our YouTube channel, start sharing your knowledge, and let's grow the community. And um, oh, most importantly, like and subscribe to this channel. And that's it for today. Thank you so much.